This is the slot dog. And this is the cyclone. Today we're going to be testing out two different products that claim to take your hot dog to the next level. This is Gadget Showdown. Every time I go to a cookout and there's hot dogs in the grill, like I know I have to get a hot dog. You have to. You have to. And the great <laughs> thing about hot dogs is like there's always a way to like make it better. You just have to like figure out what that is. I'm super excited to test these products out. I know hot dogs are so bad for you, but I love a good hot dog. I love a good hot dog too, and I can't wait to like see how the spiral hot dog actually turns out. Yeah. This is the slot dog. What it does, it creates these little cuts in your hot dog to help caramelize it and make it more crispy. You center it on your hot dog, blades down, and you're gonna give it a very aggressive push down. Ooh, look at all that force. Boom! It sticks to it at first, but what you're gonna do is just peel it right off. And there you go. Ooh. Your hot dog is fully slotted. It's kind of hard to push if you don't really get on top and give it all the force it needs to really cut through. So that would probably be a con for me. So now we're gonna try the Cyclone. Essentially, we need to put our hot dog inside of here, twist it, and that will spiral cut the dog. So, spiralizing some Jimbo dogs. I'm nervous. I know, I don't know. It looks First too... you gotta get it in there, <laughs> and then you gotta twist it. It looks like it's just coming apart. Ew. I don't... This is de-appetizing my hot dog. That's yeah, what this it is literally doing. just looks like it looks like zombie meat. A person's insides, but it's cutting. It's I mean it's for sure cutting. So I mean it's doing its job. Amazing. Yeah, these look excellent. The <laughs> process was kind of rough, yes. but the outcome, I'm satisfied. Slot dogs. Okay. That's so good. <laughs> it's, like, it's really crispy. That is so good. Mm -hmm. I cook my hot dogs on the grill until they're like burnt, like, you know, black, mm -hmm. wrinkled, all that. I feel like with this, you don't have to burn it because you're cooking directly to the inside of the hot dog and it gives it that like crispy, like mm -hmm. just that good, just the texture that I'm going for. I'm a fan. I'm a huge fan. Not bad. Mm hmm Just not the it's type crispy. of hot dog I like. It's crispy, but not as crispy. It's all right and the spirals seem to be holding in my mountains of ketchup pretty well. No mustard no leakage. <laughs> my shirt is still fully clean. The winner of this gadget showdown is three, three two, two, one, one. the slot, slot dog. dog. I'm so glad we picked the same one. I know, this is like, it's just better. It was, it was a really good hot dog. Mm -hmm. For the amount of time that it took to slot dog some hot dogs, it wasn't that much longer yeah. than just putting hot dogs on the grill and they came out tasting and looking better, Indeed. which is cool. If you're entertaining your friends or something, 
just slot dog some hot dogs <laughs> yeah. and impress them with your amazing knife skills. Right. <laughs> Say it was you that <laughs> did it. <laughs> okay, so all of you grill masters out there, what did you guys think of these products? Would you use any of them or would you just go the old fashioned way with your hot dog? Comment below if you have a suggestion for the next Gadget Showdown.